Right, I thought I'd finish with the helmet thing, but I decided to screw around. Now, since these are both, you know, you got to be careful which side you edit. You know, you try to edit the other side, it just gives you the mirror down here. But, um, yeah, but since these are parametric and they are models of each other, I wanted to widen these vents. So, um, you know, but it'll widen it on both sides. I already widened this one here. But, you know, you got to work on the correct side, you know, the one that's been mirrored, um, to have it select the features. So I was going to try to add a, you know, thicken the, see if I could thicken these and turn them into actual solids, because this is still kind of weird, but, you know, I, I doubt that it'll work, but, <coughs> you know, just something like this would probably be, I don't know, I want to say rotoformed or something like that anyway, so it would probably have a, you know, it'd be like a shell, a plastic shell of some kind, um, you know, if it's made like this anyway. <coughs> well. Yeah, that other video was fucking hour and 40 minutes long. I can't believe it. It's up almost a gigabyte. <laughs> anyway, it's got the vents all widened on that side. And likewise widened on this side because it's a mirror copy. <coughs> so I guess the parametric nature is good for something. Um, now let's, you know, I should be able to select one of these solid bodies here and try to thicken it. Um... Yeah, you know, I'll try to thicken it to the inside on this one, but the other one I may have to thicken it to the outside, which means this won't fit anymore. Um, thicken right here. Okay, I don't want ten millimeters, just uh, like say like two millimeters. Huh. <sighs> This is one of those things that won't let you preview it. Let's see. Or, yeah, I guess it will. Let's try to thicken it to the midpoint. No, side one. Okay, side two. That's better. I'm going to go 1.5 on that. Okay, so now I can't see through the thing anymore. <coughs> but I guess I'll have to add a transparent material to it. Uh, okay, so it's now a solid body. <coughs> um, I guess I don't have to change the material, I can just add an appearance to it. Um, Yeah, just go glass. trying to select a fucking face. I want the goddamn object to have the... <sighs> Fuck. I mean, this program is really driving me ape shit. What the... F
figure out. <clears throat> and what I ended up doing is just dragging it directly onto that. So that seems to have worked. <clears throat> okay. Now, on this, I'll see if I can add a thickness to it, too. So, um, and this I'm going to have to, you know, I don't know, I mean, I can try to extrude it inward, I guess. Um, but I don't think this is going to work. Um... I don't even know if, uh, should be to the inside. Yeah, I really doubt this is going to work. I don't think it's previewing it at all. Large result. So if you look at the part he drew, I mean, it's <coughs> unbelievably complex. I mean, all these bridges and stuff, I mean, I don't know what the hell. But I really don't think this is going to work because of that fucking inflection point, you know, um, that we never dealt with, that singularity, rather. Yeah, of course, it didn't work, you know, going that direction, but let's try a different option. You know, seems to work from there, but you know, you try to do it from the inside. I don't know. I mean, it is producing a preview. I'll try it again. That's what I'm saying, you know, I really don't understand what the point of doing all this fancy surface modeling is. Okay, there you go. Yeah, and it probably is because, like I said, of that singularity in it, you know, that's probably what's producing the problem. Um, I'll go put a hole in it, is what I'll do. Okay. You know, I'm drawing a lips down there in the top plane. Um... Surfaces. Well, I don't know if this is what I want to do, though. Okay. I want to keep this surface. Okay, now in theory that should have gotten rid of our inflection point. <clears throat> you know, because I just simply cut it out and I could knit this back together again, but uh, I don't mind there being a hole in it because he had shitloads of holes in his. Um, now let's try to do a, an offset surface and see if that works, uh, or a thicken operation on it. Okay. I forgot to check and see if it was even doing a preview. I don't know. Anyway, I'll you know stop the video and let you know. If, nope. So apparently it wasn't just that. Yeah, but again, 
and since it's not even giving us a preview, you know, that's pretty ridiculous. Okay, fuck it, I'll try it this way. I'll let you know if this ever works. I mean, I don't think it's going to work. I'd be amazed if it did. That's why I don't really see the point to this kind of modeling. I don't know what you're supposed to do with it. You know, you're going to make a fucking complex surface. I mean, again, this is only good to put in video games or something. It's not good for, yeah, I mean, because, yeah, this, this, won't, this won't work at all. So... I think I got that and you know that point but yeah I mean it won't work I mean there's no way so <clears throat> but yeah I mean I don't understand what the you know I'd never want to fucking design uh, any kind of surface in a program like this this sophisticated you know again without knowing what the fuck you're gonna do with it because something like this wouldn't do you any goddamn good at all I mean, if you can't turn this into a solid you know what good is it you know, there's just no good in creating a solid this sophisticated because the program can't do anything with it. Um, I, I don't know what the point to it is, you know. Um, <laughs> I don't know if somebody can create a mold out of it or anything like that. Or you certainly couldn't create uh, any kind of mold that had any kind of thickness to it. That's for goddamn sure. Anyway, it was a thoroughly pointless exercise. But, yeah, I was going to say, this is one of the reasons I don't like working with surfaces, because you always run into shit like this, you know. But, again, I would have been amazed, you know, as we were drawing this this thing, you know, if this would have even come close to working. So, <clears throat> and there's just no fucking way. It's way too complex, um, you know, with all these fucking, you know, I mean, I can't imagine what kind of mathematics they're throwing at this, trying to, you know, trying to make this fucking thing work, and, um, you know, I, I just, that, that's my whole point, why do something, you know, that you, you're not going to be able to do anything with, I mean, it's just, it's ludicrous, you know, it's fucking totally, you know, totally idiotic, so... Anyway, yeah, yeah, there's absolutely no way to make this work. I mean, you know, biggest bunch of bullshit, you know. Throw a course out there on something, you know, that honestly can never be turned into a solid part. Kind of stupid, really. That's what this solid modeling crap's all about, right? Anyway, fuck this.